for his project of the second semester of Master 1. 2014 promotion of Mechatronics Department of ENS Ren had to design an electric car intended to participate in the Shell Eco Marathon taking place in London from June 30 to 3 July 2016, in the Urban Concept category. The vehicle made by previous students did not have a suspension system, which favored the spread of vibrations in the vehicle, damaging electronic equipment and annoying the driver during the race, without guaranteeing the contact of the drive wheels with the ground. Once the settings of the shock absorber system made, the rear suspension will filter frequencies above 4 Hz and so fulfill the specifications established during the first semester. The solution adopted for the rear suspension is a suspension called swing arm, where left and right wheels are not connected, both light and robust. It guarantees a constant contact of the drive wheel with the ground. The aluminum fixations of spring damper system and suspension arms were machined at the ENS. They were then welded to the chassis at the AFPI, which has significantly reduced the mass of these parts. For the sake of simplicity, transmission and freewheel system are embedded on the left suspension arm. This constraining connection must be set before the race to ensure sufficient tension in the chain and alignment between the freewheel sprocket and the crown. This setting is made with a conical fitting held in position by two lock nuts. The choice of the spring damper system has been made with the front suspension group, allowing more modularity. The model used is the RockShox Monarch R, an air damper bike offering great opportunities in adjustment of damping and stiffness. It is pivotally connected to the chassis via an axis steel stopped axially by two nuts, and in connected with the suspension arm with a steel pin held in position by a shoulder and a circlip. Suspension arm machined at the ENS in C35 steel is the main part of the rear suspension. The latter is linked to the chassis by in steel axis with two plane bearings. It was the most difficult part of designing the suspension, mixing geometric conditions imposed by the functional specifications, weight minimization and dimensioning constraints. 